Hey everyone, welcome back. As you can see, I am being a fashion model, showing you guys right now these nice, high quality sunglasses with UV 400 to protect your eyes from the harmful UVB rays from the sunlight. You can snatch a pair for yourself on Amazon.com. The link is in the description of this video also you will find there a code to save you 10% off your entire purchase you can choose from a different variety of different styles of lenses and different shades of the color in the lenses as well I totally recommend good quality and very stylish these are the four styles Soho's was nice enough to send over to me and stay tuned for the end of this video I am gonna give away one pair and they each come with their little carrying bag and a little coffee to wipe them clean so check out the links in the description hey everyone welcome back to my channel I am wearing my Soho sunglasses they're nice huh they're very pretty I like their style anyways um it's time to do what's inside my easter bins yay i've been waiting to do these videos i'm either gonna have two parts or three parts because i have three more bins inside my garage so right here i have a bag one bin and then two bins that's what i'm gonna do today in this video so like i said we might have a part two or a part three either or um but for sure a part two but yeah, I'm excited. I can't wait to see what's inside my bins. I know you guys have been waiting for this video also. Like I said before, I started doing what's in my bins, I think. Uh, for Halloween of last year, I started showing you guys what's inside my bins. And I know you guys like those videos. So yeah, um, I've kept doing them for, or I've been doing them since for every holiday. So yeah, let's see what's inside this baggie my gosh let's see who remembers her look at her oh my gosh let me move this bin down because it's in the way right now okay look who remembers her from last year oh my gosh she was a total score i believe she was um 25 dollars if i'm not mistaken look it's the big beautiful easter hello kitty bunny greeter look at her i think she is so gorgeous i think she's like cuter than the ones they even made this year though the ones they made this year they're still obviously super cute but she's big look at her she's holding an egg her fuzzy um bunny costume she's just a cutie pie so yeah i've been having her since last year cute greeter stand her right here hopefully she doesn't fall all right now we're gonna get into this bin over here let's see all right first thing is this big sign i got this sign at um big lots about two years ago i believe they were 90 percent off so i only paid like a dollar something and look how big it is so pretty a gingy house look at gingy. oh hello kitty wants to fall see let me lay her down it's if you can see it's kind of windy but it feels so good um look a little gingy house yay you know i found some this year already i found a couple little ones and some are also pink but this one is different look at it it's so cute so first gingy house how fun all right let's see Oh, I remember these from Ross. Look, remember these? They didn't bring them back this year. I did get the three of them. They, there's three different ones. So they're bunny planters with four little like daisies up there. So this one, look, they're ceramic. Look at how gorgeous that is. This one has the pink flowers. Let me show you the other ones. Look, this one has the yellow flowers. Aren't they so adorable? Look at that chunky bunny. This one has the white flowers. 
so yeah i had to get to three of them they're just so gorgeous i love these so much from ross last year right next we have this pedestal this one it still has the price there i got it from the thrift and i think i only paid 150 for it look how pretty it's perfect the pastel colors for easter and it is ceramic next we have this jiggly toy remember i told you i had one it lights up but i can't tell right now with the sun but i got the chick then i have two of these light up buddies um let me see i took the lights the batteries out because if you leave the batteries in sometimes they explode so we have two of these they could also be little ornaments see you can hang them then let's see what's in this bag these are the trees i was telling you about from nordstrom rack and still they have nothing um for easter look um they light up but uh, did i take the no the batteries are in this oh my gosh why didn't i take the batteries out mm -hmm. hopefully they didn't explode let me see well obviously they don't work anymore i'm gonna have to replace the batteries but look they are the ceramic beautiful easter light up trees i'm telling you they match the little ones that i got from hobby lobby remember so these came from nordstrom rack and this one was only ten dollars that is such a good deal look at that as the um egg up here all the beautiful pastel lights so this is the baby blue one i did get i think two or three i'm not sure we'll see if they pop out in this bin right next look at these i believe these came from michael's or hobby lobby little birdies in their little nest with eggs how cute then we have here some carrot lights and these let me see yeah these have a timer which i also got from big lots at 90 percent off so i think they were like less than a dollar with a timer that's awesome they're carrots I see these are mugs these are my Easter egg mugs look these are my Easter egg mugs so cute they're um trans pack I got these at Ross last year I don't I don't think I've seen these yet um at Ross this year but look how cute so I got this one I believe they were like five dollars let me see oh this is I think another tree Yeah, it is. Look, this is the pink tree. See how gorgeous they are with the eggs on top? So this is, is the pink one. This one, I did take the batteries out. Oh my God, so I got three trees. This is, I think, the white one. Let me see. Yeah, so I got the three colors they had available. Again, they had also a bigger style, but I got the smaller style that they had. Look, look at how pretty. For ten dollars, that is an amazing deal. And gosh, I hope they bring back Easter decor at Nordstrom Rack. Cause look, so cute. All right then, we have this. I think it goes together. Oh, who remembers this one? Oh my gosh, yes, I got it at Home Goods last year. Six dollars. Look, it's a little chick canister. I forgot I had this one it's gorgeous look at it for my salt or sugar oh it's ceramic oh my god a bee and i love it so much all right next we have my dirty um yellow marshmallow peep keychain i need to clean it it's so dirty but i used it last year i believe i got this from walmart for my keys and then let me see i have this blue ceramic basket i have easter grass in here then i have this cute wooden sign this one came from the thrift look it still has the price back there look how cute it is it's cute for a family of four i might get rid of some of my easter decor that i already have as you know i've been hitting the jackpot in the stores buying so much this year so i might get rid of some items i'm either gonna post them separately for sale on Facebook or on Poshmark or make like a Easter box bundle of my decor that I'm gonna part with um, and I might sell it for like 10 or 20 dollars a box we'll see but yeah check my Poshmark I'm always adding like um, new stuff on there and use my code vlog with Cindy 
I'm gonna paste the links in the description of this video. Use my code so you can get a $10 credit if you use it, I believe. But yeah, look, this is a sign. I might part with this one. I might. It's cute, huh? Then this is my butter dish. And again, I got this at Nordstrom Rack for $10. Look, and it's so cute. It's the carrot butter dish. It's ceramic. Look how fat that carrot is. It's so cute. Love it. Then the rest are gingy houses. Eee! Look, this is the little tiny yellow one. My friend Danielle gifted this one to me last year. Isn't it so cute? I have seen this one in store this year, but didn't pick it up because I knew I already had it. Look how gorgeous it is. One of my favorite of the little ones. This is one of my favorite. Oh, it's gorgeous. All right, then we have a medium sized one. This is a white one. I don't think I've seen this one this year, actually. Oh, it's so pretty. Look at the eggs on top. It was $20 last year from Marshalls. Look at it. It's so gorgeous. Look at the little um rabbit in the front with the little chick. Look at the detail of the eggies on the roof. Such a cute house and I'm happy it did not get yellow. Oh, I love it. It's so gorgeous. Then we have this one. Remember this one I have seen already this year at Home Goods, but I didn't pick it up because I already had it. Look, my friend um, got this for me last year. Remember if you saw the video last year, she found a lot of the Easter houses for me and she mailed them to me because last year I wasn't so lucky as I was this year or am this year. But yeah, so this is the purple one, super gorgeous. And again, it's very white, it did not get yellow. And then one more house in this box. So look, this was a little bin. It wasn't even like a big bin. And I was able to fit all that in this one bin. So yeah, if you figure out you know how to store your stuff correctly yeah you can take advantage of just one bin to put in a lot of stuff because i know that I'll, i get a lot of comments of how do you store all your stuff or where are you going to store everything you buy yeah, just you know bins you just have to think how to fit in there fit everything in there really good all right so this one is a blue one look gorgeous again it's white it didn't get yellow and i don't think i've seen this one this year at the stores so yeah, i'm happy i have it from last year it's so gorgeous look at the white picket fence beautiful houses so yeah that was it for bin number one now let's get into bin number two that bin is even bigger so let's see what's in there let me put everything back in here and then we'll continue with bin number two Okay, friends, so we have bin number two over here. Let's see what's inside. Ooh, goody, goody. Look at that. All right, so the first thing is this. I believe, yeah, this is from Hobby Lobby. Look how cute that sign is with a bunny butt. It says welcome and it's sticky. then we have this pretty um beautiful bee pom-pom garland this one i got from ross look at how cute this is the bees isn't that gorgeous i love this one so much perfect for spring easter decor then there's a gingy house look the pink one yay i have not seen this one either this year it was 20 dollars last year from marshall's Look at that, how cute. I love how these are like smaller size ones and then this year I found big ones. Look at that, so beautiful, love it. Then look what we have here. We have the three of them. So these my friends sent me last year because um, these are from the Dollar Tree Plus. So last year we didn't have a Dollar Tree Plus so she got me these look at that um they were five dollars each and they light up so nice they're thicky peep lights and i got these three the best colors <laughs> then over here i have some fun straws i got these from um ross last year look how fun they are watch 
These are even cute just um, for decor in your kitchen. Look at that. Aren't these so fun? I believe they're only like $2.99. So it comes with a bunny, an egg, um, tulip, and the little chick bunny. So yeah, those are super fun. I do use them for drinking as well. All right, then here I have these eggs I got from Hobby Lobby. They're chick eggs. Look how cute. What are you? This is a canister. Wait, where's the um the tab? Who remembers this one? They don't have these this year. They were from Home Goods last year, $5.99. Where's the top? I think it's this. Yeah, look. Look how cute this is. Oh my god, the chicken and the cracked egg. That's gorgeous. So I have one for my sugar and one for my salt. All right, then I have a mug here. This one I've been having for quite a while already. Look how cute it is. It's this, um, oh, I chipped it. I remember it was chipped from last year. Uh, I can't remember actually where this is from, but look how cute. The bunny mug. Then I have some Easter egg lights here. I don't know where these came from. I've been having them for a long time. So here's another egg cup. So I think I only got two from last year. Look, look how nice they are, huh? So pretty that I remember I only got two. So this is the other one, but we'll see. Then look, here's one of my carrot trees. Remember I did see these already this year. They are by, Mar by Martha Stewart. Look how gorgeous they are. When they light up, they look so pretty. I like, they, she also has the egg ones, remember? But the carrot ones are the ones that I like better. All right, then we have this sign. Who remembers this from Ross last year? Look, carrot patch, it was $11. Um, I haven't seen nice signs like this at Ross this year. Hopefully they bring some in because look how nice this is. I love it for the kitchen. Then, oh my gosh, look at what's this. The carrot house. I have not seen it this season, also this year. My friend was the one that was able to get it for me last year. Sorry, I'm outside filming, so outside noise. Anyways, look, um, and last year I didn't see it either. So thank you um, to my friend for getting this one for me last year. Look at that gorgeous house. So beautiful, look at that bunny up there. I love it. I think she got it at Home Goods. And then this one, I think this one I found last year. Look at it, the gorgeous, it was $30 at Marshall's, the gorgeous yellow house. Look at that, I like this shape of the house, it's so different. And then the cute bunnies, it has two bunnies. Look at that and this egg here, the top of the um, door is so beautiful. All right, then this one, I was so lucky to score. This was a hard find for me last year, but eventually I found it. Look, the flower pot house. Who remembers this one? It was so popular last year. And like I said, very hard to find, but I got lucky. And it was $30 at Marshall's. Look at that. What a gorgeous house. And none of these are yellow, so I'm happy. This is the Nomi's, the Nomi couple. So cute. Right, then this is a resin house. I can already feel it. Yeah, I've seen these this year. So I have seen these. Look, these are the resin ones. These look like cookies. Look at how cute that is. The pink house. And this one was $15 last year. I think that's how much it is this year. Gorgeous house. All right, then here is the pink Easter truck. Again, I think my friend is the one that found it for me last year. So she mailed it to me. Um, I forgot where she found it, maybe Home Goods, but look at this truck. Isn't that beautiful? Look at the thick egg that has back here. Such a gorgeous, gorgeous house. And then the bunny in the back. It's so beautiful. Look at the wheels. I love it so much. And we have another resin house. Let's see. Look, this one. And this one I saw this year at Marshall's already. Um, this one was 17 last year. Look, 
again it looks like a cookie house so that's why i buy the resin ones that also but they have to look like cookies so stinking cute all right we have a little item here oh these are my little coquettes i think i got these from ross let me see or home goods oh no i think ross so this is the blue one it has a little bunny on top and look i love the speckling it has speckling super cute you know i love my little coquettes we have a easter mug this one i believe got, i got from tj maxx a few years ago it was like two dollars on sale i like the little handle and it says happy easter double-sided and it's purple from the inside oh my gosh yeah this one oh my god do you guys remember when i went to savers the thrift store and i found it because i didn't find it last year i was hunting and hunting for it and I never found it like at Home Goods or TJ Maxx. Look, then I found it at the thrift and I think I only paid $12.50 for it. No, $10.49, look, $10.50. Oh my gosh, this was an amazing jackpot find at that thrift store. Look at it, it's the sheep house from last year. Oh my God, it is so beautiful, look at it. Look, the little egg there, <gasps> little eggs on the roof. It is so beautiful. So yeah, lots of gingy items in this bin, huh? My carrot house, oh my gosh. But yeah, friends, that was it for the bins. What's in my Easter bins for this part one? Let me know what you think. Oh, I'm so happy of all my gingy items. Um, I did pick out a few items that I might, you know, start putting in a box to sell on Poshmark. like getting rid of my easter stuff some of it um but yeah let me know which one was your favorite item and are you excited for part two again let me know in the comments don't forget to check out my poshmark okay friends so also don't forget to check out soho's and use my link to get a discount i honestly did like their glasses when they reached out to me i told them you know what you know it's fine if you want to send me glasses is cool but i'm gonna give my honest review like always and i actually do think they're nice they're good quality so that's good and i'm gonna give away a free pair of sunglasses so if you're interested i'm gonna show you which ones all you have to do is comment in this video also be subscribed so please check your subscription i know again youtube keeps taking away oh my god there's a bee <laughs> i'm so scared youtube keeps taking away um my subscribers <laughs> wait a minute <laughs> did you guys see it oh my god please go away so youtube keeps like unsubscribing some of you guys and i know some of you guys have noticed that you were unsubscribed and had to subscribe again so please make sure you are subscribed to be entered to win this pair of sunglasses and just comment whatever you want and use the hashtag sunglasses and i'm gonna pick a comment i'm gonna choose it this time the winner and I will announce the winner in the What's in My Easter Bins Part 2. So these are the sunglasses that I'm going to give away. I did try them on, you know, in the beginning of the video. But these are the ones I chose to give away. Yeah, they're very nice. So these are the ones that I'm giving away. Look how pretty. And again, they come with a little baggie and the cleaning cloth. So they won't get scratched. Um, but yeah, so if you want to enter to win these pair of sunglasses, just leave a comment, use the hashtag sunglasses, and I will announce the winner in the Easter Bins Part 2. So yeah, friends, before you go, please hit the like button. Thank you, Soho's, for my sunglasses, and we will see you next time.